Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video you can follow me on three beautiful hikes on the Faroe Islands. I will provide some useful tips for those who are planning a trip there and if you like to travel viscerally through YouTube videos, then just sit back and enjoy the scenery. If you are particularly interested in one of these three hikes, you are welcome to skip to the one that you would like to see. You can do that by clicking on the timeline. Let's just get to it. The first hike I took was from the town of Leirvik to the town of Nordgotta. This is not a well-known hiking route and you won't find it in the brochures. I was staying in Leirvik and was looking for hiking routes close by and after some research I found that there was an old road that goes over the mountain. It was used by the locals in the old days. Here are a couple of tips for this route. The starting point for the hike is the football field in Leirvik. As you can see this place surely has a very eerie feel to it. And during the hike I did not meet anyone on the road. Also be prepared for a steep climb and a steep walk down to the valley. These things are called cairns. C-A-I-R-N and they are pretty much sort of signs where to follow the route or I don't know they had all sorts of weird and mystical uh, <laughs> descriptions on the internet but as we know the internet is itself a very mystical place Okay, so this was a super nice hike. I totally recommend it to everybody. It takes about one and a half to two hours to get there. But uh, nice view. Um, do it, do it. My second hike was on the island of Norsoy, which is situated very close to the capital city of Torshavn, and you can get here on a short ferry ride from there. The hiking route goes from one side of the island to the other and what you should know is that this one is a very long one. It takes at least three hours in one direction. So my recommendation for you is that you take an early morning ferry ride to make sure you have a whole day for your hike. Lastly, have good footwear. The terrain is wet and swampy. Mm -hmm. 
the sun is here. The sun. The third hike was at a place called Hvanhagi on the island of Suduroi. This was my personal favorite because it was the most scenic of all of them. Here I only have one recommendation for you. If you like flying, then consider getting to the island by helicopter, which is very affordable on the Faroe Islands. I took the helicopter flight in the morning, went on a hike and took a ferry back to Torshan in the evening. If you have any further questions, leave a comment and I will get back to you. And if you like this video, and if you like beautiful things in life, subscribe. See you next time.